Hey, baby. What do you want to eat tonight? <laughs> what you want to... Not that. Say, say pasta. <laughs> I can't even put that in a video. Domino's? I want pasta live. Some corn and French bread meat. In Amber style, we're going to do that. We're making a pasta laya today. A little bit of oil for what? Pork. Huh? Pork. Pork. Two pounds of Boston butt that we got seasoned with sweet heat for your meat. Sear it up. All right, two pounds of chicken thighs in there, seasoned with sweet heat, right on top of the pork. And we're going to cook it another 12 minutes. 10, 12 minutes. Take up all that meat. Two pounds of smoked sausage. Full disclosure, y'all, this recipe was adapted from the Cajun Ninja recipe, but the base of his recipe is pretty much what we use. I don't want to take full credit because, I mean, he's a great cook and that's what it is. But every time my favorite song, which is La Dance de Mardi Gras, plays, I have to record and it doesn't even matter if it's something here happening for me to record. Y'all gotta get the feel for Louisiana. And this is like, that's it right there. I'm patiently waiting on my 12 inch like this from Root Tinsel. He sent me a 12 inch Root Tinsel made with teak wood and it is absolutely beautiful. Pull up all that sausage and put it right in there with the pork and the chicken and set that on the side. The stuff on the bottom of the pot right there where you sear your meat down is what you need to create the flavor in all your Cajun dishes and people call it different stuff. Graton. Graton, grado, grammy, grat in a pot. It's a bunch of names, y'all. Then none of them is wrong. But just get you that color on the bottom of the pot. If you don't, it ain't gonna taste right. To do is throw in all these vegetables and we got like two and a half bell peppers because I had a half of a red. It's never bad to put another color in there. Four stalks of celery and how many onions is that? Uh, four big onions. Four big onions. And we are feeding a lot of people and the onions are gonna pull up all the gratons, grimy, whatever, off the bottom. We we'll cook that down for about a long time. 30 minutes, 45 minutes sometimes. The longer the better. You need a little help breaking it up? Hi. <laughs> Alcohol abuse, I'm wasting his beer, y'all. The grat, graton, grimmies, they're all up because the beer and the um, onions pull it up. That's mega flavor, y'all. <laughs> We got the seasoning, so we got our about a tablespoon of this Papa Earl's. We've got about a tablespoon of garlic powder, about a teaspoon of onion powder, a bunch of parsley, some black pepper. Pour right in there. A six beef six beef bouillon cubes. Right in there. We're gonna break them up. Get it all blended together. <laughs> Eight cloves of garlic, which is gonna be about four tablespoons of garlic. I don't wanna hear nothing about my garlic, y'all. You got time to do all that? Go for it. One more. Got a little leftover chicken broth and water, so that's like what, seven cups? Yeah. Pour it all in. I don't want no Cajuns hollering at me about this either. Call at the Cajun Ninja. And let him whoop your ass. I don't care. Two cans of cream of chicken, chicken soup. Hey, look, I always put a hole in the bottom. Like, come up. Look at you getting in the video. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Y'all, I'm going to turn him into a social media cook. I'm telling you. I did it. Like I said, let the Cajun Ninja whip your ass. Go run your mouth to him. I don't care. Turn y'all up down to 300 degrees and turn it on preheated. Time to add all that meat back in. That's about six and a quarter pound of sausage, chicken, and Boston butt. Yeah, Boston butt. Mix that all together. We're going to use Fafale. Fafale. Charlie, who owns Sweet Heat for Your Meat, came to my house to bring me some of his products and stuff. And he said he uses the, the veggie spirals, like the tricolor ones, and that they don't stick at all. And they don't have any starch. And that's what he prefers and making his pasta laya. But so, we'll be fine. yeah, this is going to be great. It's always great. But that's another option you can use. And I hold Charlie's opinion 
pretty highly. So I want to try that one day. We're going to bring this up to a boil. <laughs> uh, it's, you know, all the pasta down. See, you got to push that pasta down in there. Once it gets to a boil like that, we're going to pop it in the oven at 300 degrees for one hour. Brad and Alphonse getting it done. Alphonse is the alligator, y'all. Got Ralph's French bread going in the oven. It's rested for about 15 minutes. That is flavor, y'all. Right at the end, after you let it rest for about 15 minutes. Look how pretty. Brad and Alphonse is gonna take my bread out of the oven. We got our little corn ready. We got company, y'all, so we don't got time to do a bunch of extra stuff and make a bunch of plates and make it look cute. <laughs> oh, God. This is so good, as always. we we'll do it like this. Sausage bowl. There's supper. Y'all know I gotta feed my family and that's a couple of their plates and the rest of them are here. Fix them plates, y'all. Everybody happy with their food? Mark? I ain't trying to pass a lot. Hold on. <laughs> I ain't got past the corn yet. Hold on. You going on my TikTok? <laughs> it is so good. Hell yeah. Hell yeah.